Welcome back YouTube. That pretty old spinner a little bit again here today. See what we can do. The old nice brim here. What I did, I bought me some panfish grubs. And I'm gonna try some of the different colors of these panfish grubs on this spinner here. Try a little something different, see what we can do. Oh yeah, got a good size. Blue brown here. Hey, this wind ain't doing nothing but blowing and this tide going out here, I mean it's getting. Yeah, we keep picking up one or two now. Keep having to get up into these corners and holes where the water ain't running so hard and out the wind some. I know that these panfish uh, grubs are made for jigging, but there ain't no law says you can't try different things on the spinner to see what to catch a fish. Oh, we got a mawmouth here. Nice mawmouth. Good. I've had to try to come down on them. Curve. It's been four or five years since I fished you. I used to catch some nice red breasts and stuff on this curve. Try to get out some of this wind, hard running water, because I'm telling you, that wind ain't doing but cutting it today. Yeah, good, pretty red breasts. I used to catch some nice red breasts along here on this curve, especially when it was coming drizzling rain. I'm having a hard time. Let me tell you, that wind is blowing now. Oh, a little pretty brown. That red breast pool. About the biggest red breast I caught this year. Uh, we keep just a few today. My brother's down here somewhere or another. Him and my older brother, him and uh, one of his friends, keep a few of them and give to them. What we got on here now, you two? Oh, an old crappy. We had switched over to the Charlie Brewer. We switched rods. We switched to the Charlie Brewer crappy uh, slider. We had try hit maybe this tail on here, give it a little bit more action, might get something into biting a little better. Anyhow, one thing ain't working real hot. Try something else, but I don't hardly hear too many fish feeding today. Hooked into something else here. Must be old brim the way this one's running. No other red breasts. Pretty red breasts. So, whether the fish is biting or whether they ain't, we could catch enough fish to I can put together a video today. I'm a fisherman and I make fishing videos and we got to have a video. I'm going to turn this pretty red breast back. A good fat mole mouth. I 
may have should have went to, uh, might have shouldn't have come to this tide water today. Might have should have went down to the other part of the river. But since we down here, we can make the day of it. We can catch a fish, you two. Come here, Molly. That's pretty warm out. It's always, most of the time, I keep two rod and reels on my boat, and I'll have one rod lined up with one lure on it, or one color, and I'll have another one of a different color. That way, I can switch from one to the other, and if I want to try a different color, not lose no time. Plus, if I got using a different rod, then my hand's hurting or something else, I can switch up. Give my hand a little bit of relief. If you get cramps in your hands, and it seems to help with that a lot of times. Holding one rod the whole time fishing, you can start getting cramps in your hands and stuff. That's <laughs> not knocking. Man, did he put up a fight. Boat riders is getting down here now. Down here in Black River with big old battleships. third time. I doubt it. Oh well, third time must not have been the charm. Give her one more try. been it. <laughs> Man, that's not Marco put up a fight. Alright, turn loose that tail. Don't you pop that tail off. Well, pretty brown. hear a brim popping. I'm having to fish hard YouTube to catch what I'm catching. <clears throat> YouTube on this high tide, I ain't heard these brim popping, but I heard them start sucking the top of the water. <clears throat> so I pulled out the brim buster. Still got a few earthworms left on the other D. They seem to be fighting a little bit better on top. Still ain't want to chase that beetle spin like it was. I should have, probably should have been doing this longer, but we'll try them just a few minutes like this. cork on the top. But that wind blowing so hard earlier that where I was at I couldn't fish on the top. I finally got out the wind a little bit here. Ah, missed that one. Ah. 
Uh, top water. Look at the cricket, so warm, three to one. Copper-headed brown. And the end of this hook just broke right off. If anything can go wrong, here they go wrong. Keeps me busy. Oh, shell cracker. Yeah, I really was saving a few fish in case my brother no wants them. And they've been fishing on the top the whole time. They probably got more than I got. They got you in a stump muffin. He's wrapped on a lily pad. Yeah. Yeah, old chumpy knocker. Man, y'all little stump knockers can afford to be so little in this running water. Hey YouTube, I rode uh, two miles up the river and I don't see my brother and his buddy nowhere. But this looks like a good place to turn these fish loose. But we gonna go ahead and release them. And maybe somebody will get back. Come catch them a good mess of fish sometime. nice small mouth and stuff anyhow I'm telling you it's been a windy day so I've enjoyed hope y'all have enjoyed too next time that bring us start off with the brim buster with the worms or something but better to bring crickets right now because them earthworms, the only thing about them is having to put them in and out be cooler keep them cool, keep them dying so crickets is easier to fish with right now but some places in the other part of the river I can uh, just keep stopping and digging when I want to anyhow I hope you enjoy thanks for watching the videos thanks for the uh, like likes I get um, in the comments. Appreciate your comment. Anyhow, we'll catch you the next time, YouTube.